Hey guys, how's it going? So today I'm going to prank Kate by telling her that I'm moving overseas for a new job. So the background to this prank is I actually got sent an application to apply for this job with this big video game company and the job is overseas. At first I thought, hey, that would be an awesome opportunity to go and travel overseas and work for this big company, but it's probably not for me and I don't really want to just pick my life up and move like that. So I didn't end up applying for the job. But then I started thinking, in typical Slayman fashion, how can I use this to prank Kate? So a few days ago, I told Kate about the job and I told her that I was actually thinking of applying for it. I told her the job meant I would be traveling overseas for two weeks and then I would get to come home for two weeks. And she was definitely supportive of it, although she was definitely worried about us living apart. So I left it at that. Now, today I'm about to pick up Kate and I'm gonna tell her that, hey, so I ended up applying for the job and I got it. They accepted me, I got the job. The only thing is, I'm not traveling overseas every two weeks, I'm traveling overseas for two months at a time and I only get to come back maybe for a week, which means we'll have to do long distance. We'll have to have a long distance relationship and I don't know what that means for us. And yeah, see how she reacts to that. Okay, this is probably a bad idea, but wish me luck. Okay guys, so I'm waiting for Kate right now. I am very nervous. Whew, okay, I'm gonna have to really try and sell this to her. Wish me luck. Oh, there she is. Okay, oh my gosh. Hey. Hi, honey. How's it going? Good, how Ooh. are you? Yeah, um, these are for you. What are they for? Um. Hi. Ready? I guess I'll just say it, so I've got some big news. What? Um. So remember a few days ago how I was talking to you about that job with, um, like with Yeah. Yeah? Um, so they offered me the job. What? And I accepted it this morning. <gasps> Congratulations! That's awesome! Thank you, I know, I'm so excited. Like, it, it hasn't hit me yet, but I mean, that's not really the, the news. Uh, what? So more? it's a, it's a bit more intense than I thought originally. Remember how before I was sort of saying I'll be out two weeks at a time and then I'll fly back for two weeks? Yeah. Was it like three weeks or something? I'll be gone for two months. What? So they want me to fly... Like two months and then back for two months? No. So they want me to fly around the Asia Pacific area for two months and then they said they'll try and organize at least a week and a half back home or they'll try and fly you out for a week and a half um, so we can see each other. I mean, I guess that's the How point of the job. That well, that's for the foreseeable future. That's the job. It's traveling consultant. Really? Yeah. But it means like I get to, I get to literally travel from Japan to Korea to Singapore. I mean, I'm going to go to so many places and meet so many people. I'm like, I am so excited about it, but I'm also so scared. Like it's a, such a big change. It's just a big change for me. It's a big change for us. And I know it's like a big deal for me to just like spring this upon you, Kate. But like, I, I don't want to pass this opportunity up. And, and I mean, like, I, I should have thought about it more, but they were saying someone else was being offered the same role and it's whoever wanted to get it first would get it. And I sort of just said, oh, I'll take it. I'll take it. Like, well, I'm really proud of you. Like, that sounds awesome, but I'm really going to miss you. Like two months is a long hey, time. No, we'll sort things out, babe. They'll, they'll, they'll literally, they said they'll help us see each other. We'll, we'll be able to FaceTime like all the time. But like there's time like, differences. Don't cry. Don't cry. Well, I just, I'm going to miss you. I know. I don't mean to be like a downer, but like. No, that's... I know. I know. And I mean, maybe like one day, like you could travel with me. Like we, we could sort something out. Like you could work remotely or something. I don't know. Like, you know, we could figure something out. Yeah. But like. It's just, I, I don't want to like give it up and like. You know, I, uh, I'm sitting here in my office every day and I'm feeling a bit like, you know, just stale. Like I'm just doing nothing. I'm just sitting here and it's kind of like I want to go and I want to like, silly as a town, spread my wings and do something and, and be something. And like, Being... it's selfish. I know. And I just didn't really like know what to do. And I've said yes. And I've signed the contract and like, we'll sort it out, babe. It's, it's not a big deal. People travel all the time. Can and you it... like try and like negotiate and help? No, that's the minimum. 
they firstly suggested six months at a time, and I just said, I don't know if I can do six months, and they said, well, we'll start you off with two. We may have to get you up to the six months because, you know, it's going to be very intense. And they What about the wedding? I'll have to fly back before the wedding. I'll, I'll make sure of that. Obviously, I will. I'll fly back. I'll fly back the week before. We'll be here together. We'll do it all together. It'll be fine. It'll make it, like, more special because I'll be, like, in town and, like, it'll be, like, a, you know, bit of an occasion sort of thing. Yeah. Don't, don't get upset, babe. We'll sort this out. I just feel like you're, like, gonna leave me behind. No, no. I'm not gonna leave you behind at all. Hey. Don't get upset. Do you, like, not want to get married or something? Is it just... What? No. That is not the case. Obviously, I want to get married to you. That's the most... That's what I want to do. Don't get upset. I know it's a big change. I don't mean to be upset because I I am proud of you and I know like that's a really like it's a great job and I mm. I know but I I'm, I'm gonna miss you. I'm gonna miss you, babe. Don't get no hey, don't get upset, babe. Can you can you not get upset please? I'm sorry. Babe, look at me. It'll be fine. Like, what if we ever, like, have a family or something? Like, then you won't even, like, be with me for well, that. Well, we're going to have to put that on hold for a bit, I think. We'll, you know, hopefully by that time we'll be a bit more stationary and I'll have a bit more of a stationary role and we can either be living in one city or something. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if we can put it on hold. Why, babe? We can. It'll be fine. We've been through so much together, babe. We can... This is just another thing we have to get through. I think I might be pregnant now. What? <laughs> babe, what? My period was late, and then I thought it was like, I'd, I better check, and so I got the test, and it was positive. Are you joking, Kate? And then... I didn't, what? I didn't, hey, stop. It was like a two-pack, so I did the other one, and that one was negative, so like, I don't know. What? What did you just say? <laughs> I'm joking. I'm not. What? What did you just say? <laughs> I don't hey. know. I think I might be pregnant, but I'm not going to... What? I, I'm going to the doctor tomorrow, and I don't know, like... Tell me you're joking. I have to get, like, a blood test tomorrow. You think you might be pregnant? Since when? <laughs> like, just recently. I didn't tell you because I was too scared. I didn't want like, What, babe? No, you're joking. I'm not married yet or anything. Oh, my gosh. Hey. <laughs> Baby, what? I'm joking. <laughs> I'm... Know. Are I you... I can't do this. What? No, Kate. Hey. Hey. Hey, babe. What are you... Kate! Hey, Kate, come here, what the hell? Make her mine, I'ma make her mine Said I'll make her mine, I'ma make her mine Make her mine, I'ma make her mine